Oh, I fucked up, right? So obviously, right, today, I, I haven't posted a YouTube video in, I don't know how long, right? But today I was like, yeah, fact, I'll do a day in the life. The one time I decided to do a day in the life, right? Now, I do have my life in check, I promise, but... Yeah, it's half ten and I just woke up. Alright, whatever, get over it. Alright, we're here now. Um, so, yeah, I'm going to do a day in the life today, regardless of the fact that I've just woken up like halfway through the day. Um, but, you know, with things like this, I always say, you know, rest is the most important thing. Alright, you got to get your rest. Um, and I'm training like nearly seven days a week. So, you know, any of you boys saying, mm, I, was a bit sad, I don't give a fuck. Alright, um, I'm going to show you what I weigh. And uh, I'm just going to show you the plan for the morning. Um, I have morning cardio to do. I have a lot of things on today. I also have a fucking grind because I failed my economics exam. Um, so, yeah, that's probably not ideal, but let's weigh in. Oh no. Victim weight. Victim weight. Anyways, so I am a light motherfucker. Um, but yeah, I'm basically gonna get some clothes on now. Well, probably not much clothes, but... I'm gonna put something on, and uh, we're gonna do cardio. Um, so 45 minutes cardio. I probably should be doing this on Stairmaster, but man. I had a football match last night, like, there's no way I'm getting up in the Stairmaster later um, because my legs are destroyed, um, so I'm just literally going to jump on the bike for 45 minutes, um, so I'll see you down in the gym. <sighs> Fuck. Still not shredded enough. So the first thing I'm going to do is make myself a uh, fucking shot of espresso because... Obviously, when food is low, caffeine gets high. Um, so yeah, let's make some coffee. Pretty sure, press B, R, R, and up. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. This is a big shot of espresso. Oh, it's hot. So, once I have that shot of espresso, I will also have kind of like a cup of Hydromax. So this is basically a hydration formula. It's just for proper hydration. Is it necessary? No. I kind of use it just because it fills me up a little bit more. So yeah, literally just do a scoop of this now. I'll also have a scoop of my intra. And so I'm just gonna drink this whilst I'm on the bike. Alright, let's go to the gym. Alright, motherfuckers, we are in the gym, the workplace, the workhouse, the work zone. I don't know. Alright, we're in the fucking gym. Alright, um, so 45 minutes, I do it on this bike yoke. I would record myself, man, but there's this like window here. And see the way the lighting's gone shit? I can't see, but I assume it's gone shit. Anyways, right, I basically just do 45 minutes on this bitch. Um, I just pick a, a, a weight and a resistance that like I struggle with, and I just continue that for 45 minutes. Um, so yeah, I obviously do this faster because it's just way easier. Um, I also couldn't find my headphones, man, and I just found them. Thank God. Alright, I probably would have sacked off cardio and done it in the gym if I couldn't find them. Um, but yeah, nonetheless, I will probably get a clip of me doing cardio at the end because um, I don't want to be like, because you know the people who record themselves do, doing cardio, they come off the bike, press record, go back onto the bike, do cardio, and then come off the bike, and then stop the camera, and then go back on the bike, alright, so all I'm going to do is I'm just going to record myself for the last like minute, okay, and uh, put that in the video, um, so yeah, I will see you when I'm dying at the end of cardio, alright, good luck. Alright, last minute of cardio, let's go. Mission complete. 45 minutes in the bag. Ah, so, so much more weight to lose. Nonetheless, 45, done and dusted. After cardio, I will always have a shower. Um, like, if you're not showering after cardio, man, either one, you're not going hard enough, so you're not sweating. Or else number two, you're just a smelly fucker. Um, so yeah, share after cardio, man. Come on. You know, if you're going cardio, and then getting in your car and going to the gym, fares, but like if you're going cardio, and then you've like other shit to do for the day, like I have a grind and shit, like man, no, like that'll be minging. Okay, so I'm gonna go for a shower, and then I have to eat meal one, 
and then have a grind and uh, then we are in for pull I will obviously bring you through a full day's training session as well, or a full session. Um, so yeah, really excited to do pull. Um, a lot of numbers to maintain, and all my rep ranges have kind of been brought up, so like I don't really have any six reppers anymore. It's all kind of like at least eight. Um, so yeah, T-bar row is the main movement for today. Less waffling, I'm gonna jump in the shower now, and I'll catch you after the shower. Right, we are back, so I just had my shower. And now I'm getting ready to go to the gym. So if you've been following for a while, you'll know I'll have intra. Um, so I'll be having 25 grams of this. Um, I actually recently picked up a filter. So it is now a lot easier to have my intra. Uh, there's 22, 23, 24 cent. Okay, nice. I will throw in 25 grams of that. And then like I said earlier in the video, I'll also be putting in another scoop of Hydromax. Um, so I'll have, like I said, one, one scoop when I wake up and one scoop before the gym. Um, and then I will let that filter through. Okay, nice. I also have my oats here ready because, like I said, I have to go on a grind. Then I'm going to eat these oats and then I'm straight off to the gym. Bit of a later session today. I usually like to train at like 11, 12, but unfortunately today I'll be training at about 2 o'clock. So this is basically ready now, so I'm gonna fire this in the freezer for about probably like an hour. It won't freeze, but it'll just be nice and cold for my session. And uh, I'm gonna do this grind, and then we will be off to the gym. All right, boys, little update. Um, I just got an email off, the, or a text off the grind teacher there. Got locked out of his laptop, poor fella. Um, so no grind for me today, um, which I'm slightly buzzing about. Um, so that basically means that I'm just gonna eat this now, um, and then I will be off to the gym. So actually, I do get to train at the time I wanna. So I'll probably be training about half one. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna eat my bowl of oats now, um, and I'll either catch you in the car on the way to the gym or in the gym. Like I said, we're in for pulls, so I'm very excited. So I'll see you probably in the gym. Hi boys, what's happening? So um, we're on the way to the gym. Like I said, we're in for pull. Um, I just thought I'd record a quick clip of me actually going to the gym. Um, so, life's been pretty busy. Um, this unemployed life. Uh, we are currently setting up an event in Extreme. Um, so I assume most of you watching this will probably know me personally, because I can't imagine I'll have a lot of people who won't actually know me or have met me. But if any of you haven't gotten a ticket yet, they're on my Instagram, right? Links in my bio. I'd like to think the early bird tickets will be gone by now. I think there's about six left. Um, so hopefully they'll be gone by the time this video is out. This video will probably be out in like three days. Hopefully they'll be gone by then. Um, and then there'll be a good few general admission tickets dropped out. Um, so there'll be a load of those. Um, they are for a tenner. So they're a bit more expensive. The early birds were seven, but once again, like we're still just not making any money from it. Like it just means you're donating more to the Waterford Search and Rescue Charity. Um, so yeah, if you want to pick yourself up a ticket, August 10th, seven to nine, there'll be some pretty big, big guys training. Some cool PBs get to meet me, a few other people. Uh, not that many people will want to meet me, but anyways. Um, so yeah, pick up your tickets and I will see you all there. And uh, yeah, I'll catch you in the gym next. In for pull. Um, always just start with some pullovers just to kind of get blood flowing and just so I get a bit of tension on my back before I actually go into the T-bar <sighs> just to get a pump going really uh, see ya <laughs> Right, so uh, match numbers on my top set on the T-bar, which I'm really happy about. So that was two plates for eight. I'm gonna do my back off now. Hopefully go a plate and a half for like 10 plus. We'll see.
Ah, yeah, there's no point in taking those though. You're not going to be there every session, like, do you know what I mean? So I don't bother taking those. Right, so there is someone on the single arm pull down, um, and there's not that many benches available, so I'm going to leave that off and just do this upper back bias pull down. And um, so this is with a straight bar, elbows be keeping flared, um, and obviously, like I said, we'll be biasing the upper back. So have two sets here, uh, 8 to 10, 12 to 15. So let's work. Um, seven and a half reps, which probably isn't ideal because obviously I'm not hitting that eight to ten, but you know, very close. And I would back myself to get that eight rep next time. So I'm doing another set here, won't be recording that. Um, and then we'll be jumping into a single arm lap pull down, hopefully. So I'll hopefully see you there next. Right, so second set on this is 12 to 15. Um, so I'm gonna do that now. Right, so I'm supposed to be doing a back machine row now, but there is someone on it, so I'm just gonna jump into this cable one. Also, since I'm recording today for YouTube, I'm trying to pick um, like exercises that I won't get many people in the background from, and here I think we're all good. Well, like, you know, we're doing, we're doing what we can here, right? Um, so, once again, it's gonna be a very similar movement, so it isn't the end of the world. Um, Next exercise we have is rear dab fly. I'd like to use the machine, there's someone on it. I feel like a bit of a dickhead taking up all these cables for rear dabs, but you know, such is life. These are things you gotta do to get warm, right? <laughs> All right, so the exercise I originally wanted to do was this pack fly. Um, so ass at the end of the seat, all right, this is gonna look sus, all right, I'm just gonna address it now. But you basically want your chest up against it and then you're literally flying out, keeping a slight bend in your elbows. Um, so yeah, let's go. That is kind of the guts of the session done. All the kind of heavy work is done. So like I said, we just did rear delts there. I'm gonna do some um, incline curls now, um, and then I'll either do preacher curls or standing dumbbell curls, hopefully preachers, if the lads are done. Um, but yeah, gonna do probably three sets of this, all 10 plus, hopefully. Um, so yeah, let's go. So, next exercise, we did manage to get on the preacher curl, so we do three sets here, just at a 20 kilo plate. Um, so yeah, this is such a nice preacher curl. Um, so there's two in this gym, and I just much prefer this one. Um, so I use this one. Yeah, it's kind of very good. Did 
then did some posing. I promise I don't actually look this bad. I feel like I look absolutely awful in these clips here, but the lighting is actually just ass. If you want to see my actual physique, it's up on Instagram. All right, Sam H Fitness, go check it out. Hi, I'm just home now. Um, really good session. I did a bit of posing at the end. I probably won't leave it in though. The lighting was awful. Um, so yeah, probably won't bother with that. But nonetheless, I'm gonna jump in the shower now and then I will catch you after I have a meal to eat and study to do, so I'll see you then. Boys, we are showered up. Um, so I'm gonna make my second meal now, which is gonna be a bagel, a chicken fillet, bacon medallions, cheese, and maybe some lettuce. Go-to meal of mine. Any of you follow me on Instagram will know that like this is just a go-to meal of mine. Um, I'm probably gonna jump on live for this meal um, on TikTok, so I might not be doing too much recording. I'll see when I get down to the kitchen. All right, see you down there. So um, this meal is going to be in and around 160 grams of chicken. And um, this is one of my favorite meals because like having this meal, like would I probably be better off having chicken and rice? Probably, like it probably would fill me a bit more than having a bagel as my carb source. But this meal, genuinely, like, I feel like I'm eating off plan having this meal because it's so nice. Like, I'm not even messing. It's so, so good. I love the taste of it. It just makes me fucking happy, man. Do you know what I mean? Like, I love it so much, the bagel meal I have. Um, so that's why I have it. Do you know what I mean? So, uh, yeah, I have 160 grams of uncooked chicken, which I'm trying to get on now. 154. A little bit more. Nice. All right, so 160 grams of uncooked chicken. All right, and then I like slice this up, this up into like little strips. All right, um, and then I will throw this onto the pan. And um, once again, like obviously, I'm trying to cut my chicken nice and uh, thin, so it, it doesn't take as long to cook. Because like, if you cook just a, a raw chicken breast, man, that shit could take like half an hour, forty minutes even. You know, um, no, I don't season these. All right, I don't feel the need to. And I actually think they're just as nice when they're in the bagel, when they're just plain fillets. Uh, so yeah, I'm gonna throw these on to cook now. Strips on the pan to cook. All right, and then when these are like nearly fully cooked, I'll just throw on three medallions. So it'll basically be bacon, chicken, bagel. So good, man. All right, um, I was having bagel tins. But oh, they're just not as nice and not as filling as the Fitzgerald's bagels, alright? I'll show you the bagels I use. Um, these are my go-to bagels, alright? I'd love to use the New York ones, but the New York ones are 250 calories, right? These are 220, I want to say, 230, alright? So yes, it's only 20 calories. But, do you know, like these feel way bigger than the New York ones, so that's why I go for these. Um, but yeah, I'm going to scram it, or I'm going to cook this now. I'll probably catch you when I'm eating it. See you then. And once again, I've came to the conclusion that I'm not going to be studying today, okay? Um, things have came up, I'm going for a walk with my mother. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna do that now. Um, so I might catch you out on the walk, we'll see. All right, talk to you in a bit. All right, boys, we are now going for a walk up the woods. Talk to you in a bit. Well, right, it's... right, we're out for a walk with mom. This is the view. Boys, we are back. Oh my god, I'm absolutely shafted after that. Oh my god, that was a long walk. Um, what was it? I don't know, it was probably about 5k. We were walking for about an hour, so I assume it was about 5k, right? I need my steps up on the screen somewhere, right? Outrageous amount of steps. Now, some of you might be looking at this thing. 16k, not that much. Shut up. Right, shut up. It is a lot, right? It's a lot for me, okay? Especially when you had a match last night and you have a match tomorrow night. Probably not the brightest idea. But, nonetheless, alright? I'm just... just working so hard lads but uh no i have one more probably big meal to get in and then i'll probably have a protein shake or something because my protein hasn't been the best today i'm a bit low on it and um, but i do have a good bit of food left i think about a thousand calories so yeah i will catch you in the next meal right there we have it the last meal of the night, um, well, my last big meal, which is chicken and noodles. This is absolutely my first time making this, absolutely winged it, um, but here we are. Um, that leaves me with 200 grams of protein hit, um, which was my main goal for today. Um, so yeah, happy days. I'm gonna scram this now, then I'm gonna watch some TV and uh, have my bag of popcorn. So I'll see you then. And that is it, guys. This is my last kind of snack. 
I'll leave the calories and macros and all that fucking important shit on the screen. I'm gonna leave this video here. If you liked it, maybe drop a like, maybe a comment, maybe subscribe, maybe revolute me a tenner, whatever you wanna do. Alright, see you in the next video.